We are Rural from the Roots Up. Welcome to the village of Andrew, located at the junction of Secondary Highway 855 and Highway 45, home of the world's largest mallard. Andrew is an active community with a strong volunteer base and hosts a number of popular events such as the annual Garlic Festival and Sport Off. In 1992, the renovated school and village complex housing the public library as well as the duck stop containing the bowling alley was officially opened. It's a, it's, it's a huge part of our community and it would be a shame not to have our, our kids, you know, to have a beautiful playground for our kids to play in and a beautiful playground for not only school age kids but also the younger kids and, and even some of the older ones with cousins and relatives and friends to have a nice place for them to get together and a place to kind of still spend time outdoors and, uh, and enjoy time together with community and friends. So. Um, I think the playground is important for getting together with their friends, for families getting together. Um, makes the school look more appealing to have the playground. And also it makes the town look good because there's a playground for visitors or locals to just go with their family, friends, a meeting place. Um, it's very important. I think play playgrounds are a very necessary thing for any community because children need to get out and play, they need it for their growth, they need it for to make good friends and it's a necessary part of their daily living. Parents need to get the kids out into the playgrounds and without them I think it's a very disaster for the community. I think the playground's really important to us because every recess is pretty boring if we didn't have it and I think we'd lose a lot of students if we didn't have them. When I first came to the school in grade 5, I had no friends, and I met more friends on the playground. And if I didn't meet those friends, I wouldn't be that happy here. The school at Andrew is a very integral part of the community, offering quality education, as proven by the graduations, and etc. A new playground would be a, a very enhancing and enticing amenity for perhaps younger families to consider moving to this village which is no longer just a place for retirees. The uh, playground itself, the existing one, you often see children there playing all the time. Sometimes they're there with their parents, sometimes they're there with with their grandparents as well, and sometimes we have visiting children as well that that gather on, on weekends especially. Therefore, the playground is quite, quite heavily used and it's a very big part of our, our schoolyard and our school. We certainly would like to bring it up to uh, better standards perhaps and it will be a, just an excellent addition to the school, the facility that is there already. Our playground has seen three decades of climbing, swinging, sliding, laughter and tears. It's growing old and the government has decided it is time to retire our wooden structures as they are no longer safe. Our dream is to have a playground with structures for everyone, baby swings for toddlers, tables and benches for parents, wheelchair activities and the new style of outdoor fitness equipment accessible to all. Our children are the roots of our real community. Like the crop in our fields, whether you are a child, the seed, or parents who have blossomed and grandparents who have planted the roots firmly in our community, we want to provide a safe, entertaining and exciting place to gather and enjoy.